So with the Tour de France currently underway and lots of drama there, cycling fever has taken over. And here in Cape Town, we are so proud to say that they're moving ahead with the Neisner Cycle Tour. The Neisner Oyster Festival is also kicking off a great opportunity for you to hashtag ride for a local. But of course, built into that, we are seeing an incredible growth of an unbelievable organization. I'm talking about Velokaya, creating champions on and off the bike. We had the opportunity of doing uh, the Cape Town um, Cycle Tour with some of the Velikaya riders and they put us in our place. They were absolutely amazing. But we are joined by um, Sipo Luto and Mteta Taleli. Welcome, guys. Thank you so much for joining us. Um, Sipo, I'm going to start with you. From the professional teams, Velikaya Life Cycling Academy is all about helping children, mm -hmm. especially, but youngsters, youth that wouldn't have those opportunities to get involved with BMXing um, as an opportunity to change their life. So maybe, Sipo, you can break this down for me, my, my brother. Um, where did this, this project first come about? You have had so many successes. What, what does Velokaya mean to you? Um, Velokaya is basically a sanctuary for all the kids, uh, for all the underprivileged kids around the community, but it's not only limited to Kailicha. Um, initially, it was all to take the kids off the street and use the bicycle as a tool just to promote education. Love that. But serendipitous to that, we had a, an opportunity whereby we saw a talent and we nurtured it to a point whereby now we have riders who competed at, at the pinnacle of the sport. We have two riders who are based in Italy, actually just riding their bicycle as a... With, a, with the world. King of the Hill title yeah. under the yes, belt as well, which yes. is, is phenomenal. I mean, when you look at how um, fierce competition is on the international level, that is a real feather in your cap. So mm. well done. And of course, um, in the Neisner cycle, to Luta, you guys are going for a podium finish. How's the team feeling? What are the, the goals for this, this weekend? We have a much strong team. We have a solid team. We have the likes of Lutalo Kaka and um, Titelili Boya. And uh, nice, uh, fresh, uh, young kids in the team, the mix-up, the likes of me. And we're pretty aiming for the podium on Sunday to go with the attacks and all that and uh, hoping for a good race. What, what is it like being a part of that team, kind of being able to ride with the guys that you look up to, to, to be a part of um, that, that feeling of being a competitive team now on one of the biggest cycle tours in the country? It's a phenomenal um, feeling. We are, we, are, we are a family before we are a team, and we are a good team on and off the bike, and we help each other whenever we can, and our education and in the sport. So, yeah. It's a great team. Oh, be. man, I'm, I'm so proud of you guys. I'm Teta Lile. Um, this is a much bigger race when we take into account what's happened in Neisner at the moment. You guys yes. aren't just riding for yourselves this weekend. You're riding for Neisner. That's got to yes, feel pretty good. Yes, 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 yes. Um, uh, for those like I uh, want to be riding, uh, the, can be able like, to, to help other people from the Neisner by uh, donating, especially like uh, donating whatever they can to donate, which that would be like uh, very helpful. Uh, for the people are at Neisner. Um, and, and we know the need is massive, and I'm so proud of, yeah, of yeah. Neisner for stepping up and continuing with the Oyster Festival, continuing with the cycle tour. Exactly. When, when you get to see these, these young riders have that moment of self-actualization, when they, they're able to step up onto a podium or even just finish a grueling mm. race, how does that make you feel, Sipo? It's, 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 there's no words that can actually describe it, to be honest with you. I mean, uh, you've just mentioned something that has happened. It's part of history where Nicholas Lamine, a former graduate of Velokaya who so cool, made history by, by getting the king of the mountain at the Giro d'Italia, you know, and you groomed that kid, you, you were part of his um, life, so it just, it's indescribable to be honest with you. Uh, and I'm sure the successes achieved off the bike mean even more. Exactly. Gentlemen, all the best of luck with your endeavours. Look forward to seeing you on that top spot on the podium. <laughs> no my pressure. Friend. Come on, no pressure. <laughs> no pressure. Um, but a big congratulations to Neisner for putting this all together. Um, hashtag ride for Neisner. Mm -hmm. Go out there and support the local community. There are five races that you can take part in. I know that entries are still open. You'll pay a small entry um, a penalty fee and obviously not be seated, but you can still get down there and support the local community. So check out all those details on our websites and go and support a community that needs it.